this is Studio. Turn Standard into Stunning. Studio can take a designer all the way from an elegantly simple line drawing to a full-blown detailed elevation rendering with actual fabrics, colors, and furnishings. Create quarter-inch scale floor plans, appealing storyboards, or marketing materials. Choose from the thousands of designs in the image toolbox or Draw your own with a wide range of graphic design drawing tools and fill effects. Let's design a one-wall elevation rendering. Using the drag and drop technique and Studio's step system, select a wall template and begin layering the room. With the Benjamin Moore Virtual Fan Deck open to the side of Studio, select the wall and the eyedropper tool and touch the color of the paint. Now we'll add our window treatments. Resizing to fit. and Euro pleat panels. Which will lengthen and add our fabrics. A gold silk for the draperies and a woven woods fill for the Roman shade. We'll change the height on this to 8 to give it a more realistic appearance. Once the basic drawing is done, add more color, fabrics, texture, furniture, and accessories. Should there be any changes, go to the Home tab and under Add New Page, create a copy of the page and fabrics or wall color can be modified easily. The storyboard templates in the Studio program can be easily customized to reflect your branding. Here we've used a landscape-oriented legal size product storyboard and added our own color scheme, graphics, logo, and text, along with fabric samples, a lamp, and the paint chips next to our rendering. Studio gives you all the tools you need to draw a floor plan. We'll start with a rectangle, change the footprint to our room size, 14 by 17, and we'll change the line width to 8 pixels to represent the wall thickness. We'll drag on a door, and some windows. Let's zoom in, duplicate the window, and position it on the right hand side. Next we'll add a bed from the furniture category. And a chair.
rotating it. And it's easy to change the positioning of the other images using one of the rotate tools. Here we show the finished floor plan using an imported image of the actual carpet, the fabrics on the bed and the chairs, and other furnishings. One of the fastest ways to use your studio program is to design directly on a photo of the client's room. Using the Import Image button, locate the photo, resize, and here we're using our logo template. We'll need to change the drawing scale so that we have an accurate representation of the fabric and can use our dimension tool to measure elements of the design. Selecting the dimension tool, we'll drag across the doors, which are six and a half feet wide. This tells us we need to change the drawing scale, so we'll use the Set Scale tool, click, drag across, and release and type in the actual measurement. Now we can begin adding our window treatment and accessories. We're going to use grommet panels. Add our fabric. And edit this to the actual repeat, which is 18 inches vertical repeat. We'll ungroup this now so that we can reposition it. Zoom in to get this exactly where we want it to be. And let's look at the other side. We can use the nudge tool to move it in smaller increments and lengthen the pole. Next we'll use our photo clip tool to cut out the sofa and the chair to bring them in front of the drapery. Select the photo, bring to the front, and then select the photo clip tool. Trace around the outline of the furniture, clicking for each turn. around the curved areas. You may need a few more clicks of your mouse. Down to the bottom and double click to finish. Select the original photo and send it to the back. And finally we'll add a floral arrangement. Using the import image button, click again in the workspace and locate your accessory. I've selected this orchid. With the photo knockout, we can erase the white background and then resize the image to the proper scale. Fast, easy, and the client loves it. Try Studio for 30 days free. We know you will love being able to add a whole new dimension to your firm's design services.